Hello everyone, welcome back to another video on my channel. I am so excited for this video. As you can probably tell by the title and what's in front of you, I'm going to be unboxing Doctor Who The Collection Season 24. At the time of recording this video, it is the day that it went out. Um, this is probably going to be the quickest turnover that I've ever done um, on my channel, recording and then uploading straight away because um, it's Friday and not many people will have this yet. I ordered it from Zavi um, and it's come early, quite early in fact. Um, so I just want to get this video out here, unboxing it, showcasing it to you. I'm so excited. Um, so let's just look at the packaging. It's still in its cellophane, but I'll get rid of that in a minute. So obviously that's the front that you've had a nice look at. It's got the beautiful new 12 logo, which I think looks a lot nicer. And eight discs as well. Turning over to the spine, there's the spine. We've got McCoy up here. And it's quite, it's quite fat. Um, I believe it's about the same width as season 14, if that's any comparison. And here is the lovely blue back. You can have a nice look at that. We will be going through some special features together in a minute, so don't worry about that too much. And there's the other side of the spine, pretty much the same. So I'm going to quickly pause the video and get it out of its cellophane. All right, so I've done that now. That was a pretty easy job, just with a handy pair of scissors here. So let's, let's just take off um, the J card. So I believe that's what they're called. So it comes in its little... Oh, there we go. So that's off. Here it is. That's the J card. Turning it around. Well, that's awesome. And now we're looking at the actual thing itself. Oh, look at that. Now let's turn it around. Actually, let's turn it around in a minute. Let's just get a nice little glimpse, glimpse of all those villains who are in this lovely season. I don't know if I've mentioned this on this channel before, but I'm a big fan of season 24. Um, I don't care what anyone says, it's brilliant. And the artwork is so stunning. Lee Binding has done such an excellent job here. So let's turn it round to the back where we should see. Wow, look at that, the classic TARDIS shot. This time the TARDIS is upside down and I assume this is from Time and the Rani, um, with the Rani's laser where the sixth Doctor is regenerating inside. But yeah, beautiful artwork as per usual. Very interesting design, obviously with the TARDIS being upside down, I don't think they've done that before, but certainly unique now. <laughs> Let's, this is the moment we've all been waiting for. Let's open it up together. Are we ready? Countdown, three, two, one. <gasps> wow, oh wow. Now, which side do I look at first? That is the question. Let's look at the discs first, um, because they're amazing. So let's just... Time in the Rani, part one. So I believe each story has two discs. So that'd be exciting to delve into this. So there you go, we've got McCoy in, McCoy, um, in Colin Baker's outfit with the Tetraps surrounding him. That looks amazing. Oh, who's this? Bonnie Langford screaming. That is a classic shot, isn't it, really? Time in the Rani, part two, an excellent story. I'm so excited to delve into this box set. Paradise Towers, part one. Look at that, Richard Bryars and McCoy looking very apprehensive there. And another excellent story. Oh, disc four. This is one of my favourite disc art. You've got Mel with the two women. It's been a while since I watched Paradise Towers, but it is excellent. That is just so... Let me look at look at Bonnie's face there. It's so funny. Next up, probably my personal favourite from the season, we have Delta and the Bannermen. Oh, look at that classic shot. Don't they look great together? And then we have... Delta and the Bannermen Part 2 with... Oh, I forgot their characters' names, but they're very good characters, that's for sure. Oh, amazing artwork. And then Dragonfire, a lovely story. There's Mel telling the Doctor that she is not coming with him anymore. That's a very sad departure, actually. I'm glad Mel got a good departure. And finally, Sophie Aldred, Ace, looking absolutely amazing there. Her first story. And I believe if we remove the final disc... Ta-da! There's McCoy's face, which is just excellent again. So let's pop that back in. Ooh. There we go. And let's look at the other side. So here we have some more stunning artwork. I believe it's by Lee Binding from Paradise Towers when the Doctor and Mel arrive. I do love Mel's outfit in this story. It's certainly very wacky, isn't it? Definitely reflects the season, kind of. So let's open up. There we go. Open it up there. Open it up there. Wow. Look at that. That is what I call 
some artwork. That was absolutely amazing. So, oh, we've got a little pamphlet here. What is this? Um, more exciting products from Dodger. Yeah, we don't need this. This is absolute rubbish. That is not what I'm here to see. Ah, here we go. The booklet itself. We'll look at the booklet in a minute. However, let's take a moment to admire this, which is so detailed. It's amazing. Um, we've got the sixth Doctor regenerating down here. I don't know if you can see that. Yes, you can, hopefully. Got Mel spread out. Leave the girl. It's the man I want. And obviously the TARDIS has got some smoke around it and stuff because it has just crash landed. And I don't know if you can see that, but that is the Time in the Rani set or the planet. I forgot what it's called. Um, but doesn't that look amazing? That looks absolutely stunning. So now let's have a look at the booklet in more depth. So here is the booklet. Again, like I said, amazing artwork. If we turn it around, this is lovely. We've got a photo of Sylvester, Bonnie and Sophie and Sophie Aldred's autograph um, on this little print of Sophie Aldred. Obviously, she didn't actually sign it. It is just um, a cutout of her autograph, but it is lovely. Um, I feel quite honoured to have met all three of these cast members, all of them being very, very lovely. Um, but that's a different story. Anyway, let's open this booklet because I'm stalling. Ah, here we go. Here's to the future. Welcome to season 24. Obviously, I'm not going to read it all to you, sadly. Um, but if you would like to read it for whatever reason, there you go. You can pause the screen now. I will be just flicking through the pages. So, Time and the Rani. Look at all these. Oh, my goodness me. All these special features here. So, I believe there's making of documentaries, of course. Um, but the highlight of these sets, for me, is the behind the sofa. And I'll try and point to it. I can't quite reach my... There we go. So if you want to see who is on the behind the sofa, then read that there. I'm really looking forward to it. And then over on this side, we've got some more special features. Sorry about the light, by the way, if you can. Um, there you go. So that's the time of the run. Is there more? There's more. Wow, we've got extended episodes as well, which looks... I'm just so excited to watch these because, like I said, season 24 is one of my favourites. And the lovely thing about this booklet, it comes with such more um brilliant artwork i believe this is also by lee binding i assume he's gone to great efforts here um keito mara looking very very um scary up in the top left oh this, this booklet is endless isn't it they're so lovely these products we're very lucky to get them oh and paradise towers here we go so there's more special features here you can alter an alternate score that's interesting and there's that McCoy being strangled by the machine. Look at this artwork. Wow, that is the poster for Paradise Towers looking excellent. I'll be I will speed up a little bit if anyone's interested. Then we've got McCoy doing his title sequence and Delta and the Bannermen. Um, I believe there is a new, brand new but making of documentary that oh, my finger's a bit dirty. <laughs> um, new for Blu-ray, there we go. So I'm really looking forward to going through that as well. More behind the sofa on every story. Oh, we've got Ken Dodd looking very lovely up there, and more lovely artwork. Ah, and Dragonfire, the concluding story for the season. So what, what special features do we have here? We've got commentaries, making of documentaries, behind the sofa, extended episodes, ah, in conversation with Sylvester McCoy, which I'm really looking forward to watching, and here's to the future, which is a feature-length documentary charting the dawn of this new era. Ah, so exciting. And there is some more stunning artwork. Honestly, it's great. You can't get enough of this. I'm going to be staring at this for the next few months, if I'm honest, because this might be my favourite so far. And that is the booklet done. It's very chunky. It's quite a big booklet. Oh, what an amazing set this is. So there we have it. Thank you very, very much for watching this video. I know it's been a bit um, messy and rushed, but as you can tell, I am so excited for this Blu-ray set. It is one of my favourite seasons. It is far from perfect, but it is an, a guilty pleasure of mine. And I'm so glad it's finally on Blu-ray. Look at McCoy's face. It's, I can't get enough of this. Um, but yeah, thanks very much for watching, guys. And I will see you in the next video, whenever that may be. Bye for now.